hello aspirants i am meghna hichv from cfdri so welcome to the daily booster series for the cfdri entrance exam of 2023 so we will be discussing the most important and uh, previous year question paper for boosting your preparation for the entrance exam preparation so we will do so the first question is taken from the food science so the first question is which are considered as the essential fatty acid or the polyunsaturated fatty acids so the first option is linoleic acid the first option is linoleic acid second option is linoleic acid and third option is arachidonic acid and fourth option is all of the above so essential fatty acids are the uh, fatty acids which are not synthesized in the body but it has to be met through our diet so that is known as essential fatty acid so here the lino linoleic acid linoleic acid and the arachidonic acid so these are essential fatty fatty acid so the option d is the right answer then coming to the next question the question is the codex alimentarius commission is a joint commission of so the first option is fao and who and the second option is fao and wto and the third option is unesco and uno and the fourth option is imf and fao so the first option that is fao and the who is the right answer so where fao stand for food and agriculture organization and who is world health organization and uh, where who is world trade organization and unesco united nation uh, education and scientific and cultural organization where uno is united nation organization and where imf is international monetary fund so these are so the codex alimentarius commission is a joint organization of food and agriculture organization and the world health organization so this uh, codex alimentarius commission was set up in 1963 in order to set the uh, like the food standards code of practice the guidelines for the regulation so the next question is from the agriculture so the question is which gas is released from the paddy field so the option a is uh, ch4 that is methane and option b is h2s that is hydrogen sulfide and option c is co2 that is carbon dioxide and option d is ammonia that is nh3 so the first option is the right answer so the paddy the gas which is released from the paddy field is methane that is ch4 then coming to the next question which has been taken from the zoology the smooth muscles are the first option is involuntary non striated and second option is voluntary striated and third option is involuntary cylindrical and fourth option is voluntary nucleate so here the, uh, the smooth muscles are involuntary and these are non striated then coming to the next question which has been taken from the botany so the hybrid vigor is well maintained in the first option is cross pollinated crops and the second option is self pollinated crops and fourth or third option is vegetatively propagated crops and the fourth option is all of the above so here the third option is the right answer where the veg- uh, hybrid vigor is well maintained is in vegetatively propagated crops so hybrid vigor is increase in the performance of the offspring over over its uh, over its both the parents 
flow that is known as the hybrid vapor. So uh, these are some of the questions that are really helpful. So stay tuned and uh, do uh, join uh, with the aggregation platform. They have really well crafted the crash course as well as the test series for boosting the preparation for the CFTRI exam. So do follow and stay tuned for further daily booster classes. Thank you.